Yo, what's up guys? I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media back with another Dokkan battle video. So as you guys can probably tell, I'm not in my regular recording environment. I'm actually in my bedroom because we have like 30 people downstairs right now for a New Year's party. It's actually dinner. I'm being very rude, but uh, it had to be done. You know, I promised myself I wasn't gonna make a video today. I was like, yo, Tiger, it's gonna be fine. Just take a day off. Nobody's gonna mind. But then the New Year's celebration news came out and I was like, yo, screw it. I don't care. I'm recording this video. So uh, yeah, a little bit of a low budget production today. I'm using my GoPro. Uh, lighting's not really optimal. Sounds probably not great either, but we'll make it work. We'll make it work. So let's jump into it, guys, and see what this celebration has in store for us. I did take a quick peek, but I didn't, I didn't see everything. So uh, there might still be some surprises for me, all right? So first things first, happy new year 2020 celebration is on. Yo, my arm is already getting tired. Let's make this quick. Uh, various new events are here. New Year Dokkan Festival Step Up Summit. So obviously, super exciting. I know I'm not freaking out because I honestly already got kind of spoiled by the JP side. I think theirs came out a couple hours ago, so I already knew it was on the horizon, but still, amazing step up. Uh, I, sh I think uh, if it's exactly the same as the JP side, then we're getting three total rounds, which is one more round than last year. And they also change up the steps a little bit so that you can get more category uh, units guaranteed as well, which is amazing. So looking forward to that. It's coming out, I think, in a couple hours. Uh, next up we have, let's see, new Prime Battle, that's the LR Cell, new Dokkan event, and new Extreme Z Battle, new Dokkan event. Interesting, what would that be for? We'll see, okay. So first thing is the login bonus, pretty standard stuff. Uh, some special missions, we have a new Extreme Z Awakening. Uh, this looks like it's the mass Extreme Z Awakening for the seven units, uh, like the Goku you see here, and also the Metal Cooler, the Evil Boo, the Super Saiyan, or is it Super Vegeta? Or is it Super Saiyan 2 Vegeta? One of the Vegetas, the, you know, Android, uh, Super Android 13s, and so on and so forth, so uh, I believe that is what it is, I think. Uh, meet the conditions for future Extreme Z Awakenings. Oh, is it like we have to unlock them or something like that? I'm not 100% sure how it's gonna work, but uh, basically it's for the Extreme Z Awakenings for those units. Next up, we have a new Dokkan Festival Step Up. Oh, so that's the Step Up banner coming out in literally like, uh, what is it? Five, no, my math is totally off right now. Let's say like six hours from now, something like that. We also have some stone sails, and these stone sails are really freaking solid, guys. I'm so glad they gave us the sails, because without the sails, I still would have bought stones at regular price, and it would have been a bad time for my wallet, all right? So these sails are amazing. Uh, 24 stones at the price of 12 for two. Uh, two packs available for that. Uh, we also get 120 stones for the price of 60, three times. And then we also have the regular 32 stone discount and also the 91 stone pack discount, um, which are okay if you guys are willing to pay a little bit. I mean, the 32 is really good. The 91 is a bit, a bit expensive, not a great deal, but uh, still a sale nonetheless. But the 120 stone pack and the 24 stone packs are pretty damn solid. So I, I enjoy it, I like it. I like the fact that uh, Bandai did give us uh, some decent sales for this. So I appreciate it, definitely appreciate that. We have the first form cell um, event. I'm not sure if the camera's shaky, guys. Like, my arm is getting really tired. <laughs> I've been holding up this GoPro for like the last five minutes. Um, we have, let's see, uh, some, okay, story events returning, the androids in action, and also the mysterious monster cell. And then, oh, uh, <laughs> why did I say what dope kind of, I forgot Fizz Piccolo was a thing, guys. <laughs> That's how little my hype is for this unit, all right? I forgot Fizz Piccolo was part of the celebration. My bad, my bad. Of course, the Dokkan event was for the Fizz Piccolo. I was like, yo, what's the Dokkan event for? Like, I don't, I can't, I can't think of a new Dokkan, you know, exclusive unit that would, you know, get a Dokkan event. And then now I'm realizing, yeah, it's for the Fizz Piccolo. Yo, I'm such an idiot. Okay, anyways, uh... <laughs> Let's just move on from that. So, new Dokkan Festival for the Fizz Piccolo uh, with the new AGL nail. He's actually really good. Don't sleep on the nail, guys. That nail is phenomenal. We have a category summon for worthy rivals. Skip it. Um, of course, Dokkan event for the Piccolo. We also have the return of a few other events. The um, second form Frieza, the Fizz second form Frieza, the AGL Piccolo, and also the uh, STR Kid Gohan events. You can farm them there. 
and also the um, Piccolo EZA and also the Fizz Second Form Frieza EZA will be available uh, during the event period. We're also getting some uh, weekend stuff, so a weekend login bonus, some weekend special missions, and also a weekend banner. So the weekend banner is back. Uh, it says Super Saiyan, it says Super Saiyan 3 Vegeta and Super Saiyan 3 Vegeta GT uh, arrive, but we already had them on Global, I think. Um, they just like recycled, literally recycled the messaging from the JP side because I think this banner was the first banner these two Vegetas were available on JP, but obviously they've been available on Global for a while now. Moving on, we have the Future Saga Category Summon Skip It, um, and the Extreme Z Awakening for STR Perfect Cell. So basically, um, I made a prediction video, or not so much a prediction video, but it's more like a preview video for what to expect for this Piccolo celebration, and it turns out to be pretty much exactly what JP had, with the addition, of course, of the Step Up banner for New Year's. Um, what else is on here? Okay, so the Dokkan event for the uh, Perfect Cell is available every day, makes sense. Uh, some other events returning, the Cell Games, the uh, Rage Vegeta, and also the uh, World's Strongest Nipples story event is back. And that's pretty much it for all the events, guys. So STR uh, Perfect Cell is very good. I think he is quite a bit better than the Tech Cell, and I'm really looking forward to it. Uh, I was kind of hoping, just like low-key, I thought maybe they would surprise us with the uh, Vegito Blue Extreme Z Awakening, but realistically it was way too early. Like it was way too soon for that. They had just finished the voting. I think it's gonna be at least maybe middle of February, maybe even later than that before we see it, but it is coming to global first, guys. You don't have to worry about that, so it's just a waiting game at this point. So we are getting the Cell. I'm okay with it. He's phenomenal. Um, and of course, the, the banner that comes with it and the packs, if you guys are into that, but I'm, I'm really not, uh, it's not really my thing. It's not really my thing. So excited for the EZA right there. It comes out on the 12th. Oh, that's quite a ways away, man. It's like two weeks away from now. Um, and uh, the weekend stuff right here is so we get the weekend tickets, we get some of the weekend banner. Um, don't mind that at all. There's always a chance to pull an LR, but typically speaking, uh, I just pull a lot of trash. So I'm not too hyped for it, but uh, I will take it. I will definitely take it. What else? Okay, let's move on to the special missions. I'm not going to focus too much on it. Let's just see how many stones we get. It says you can complete all the missions for 41 dragon stones. That's actually solid, guys. 41 stones. Very solid. Um, you guys can take a quick look if you want. So one stone daily for the daily missions and then, um, you know, six stones for completing all the special missions. One stone here, one stone there. So in total, 41 stones. Not bad. Login bonus. So I believe we get yeah, 20 stones for the first login. That's pretty generous. And then three stones today and then one stone rest of the way until the end of January, I believe. Yeah, end of January. And then I guess the next celebration would be for like, um, I don't know, spring or something like that. So that is login bonus up to 56 stones in total for the login bonus. And that's it. So that is everything, guys. That is everything for the New Year celebration. I don't mind it. It's basically the, like I said, the Piccolo celebration on JP uh, plus the Step Up banner, which is dropping in a couple hours. I don't know exactly how many because I'm like too hyped about all this stuff going on right now to fully compute in my mind, but uh, it's dropping soon. It's dropping soon. Good luck to all of you who are summoning. I personally will be summoning, of course, but might have to wait until like tomorrow at some point because uh, I'm probably not gonna be able to summon like as soon as it drops since uh, you know New Year's party, New Year's festivities. I don't want to do the summons like this even though some of you guys might like it. It's kind of like a vlog. Uh, I still prefer to be sitting in my studio, my setup with uh, the proper lighting and all that stuff. So uh, yeah, you're gonna have to wait a little bit but uh, it will be coming soon. My summons on the Step Up banner. And until then, uh, I don't know if I said this in the beginning of the video. If I didn't, then Happy New Year's guys. I hope 2020 is awesome for all of you, both Dokkan wise and real life wise. Uh, in any aspect basically, every single aspect possible. I hope it's amazing. And uh, lots of great content coming in the future as always. Um, pretty much daily uploads, but if I miss a day, I usually make up for it with double uploads or triple uploads in a day. So uh, yeah, lots of videos coming soon guys. And that's gonna do it for me. I gotta get back to my holiday party. Um, as always, if you guys enjoyed today's video, then make sure to like, 
the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here. Until next time, I hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Apricot Media, signing out.